Oh, hoopla-la. Hi, I'm Ben Morton, uh, coach of the Keel Squirrels, captain of the Mighty and Amazing Works, former coach of Team UK, former president of QUK, and all round great guy. How would you explain the difference between coaching and captaining? It depends from team to team. Uh, captains can sometimes take on a coaching role if there isn't anyone specific, but coaches are more about the development of the team and practice and stuff, whereas the captain, especially in Kiel's case, is the one that does all the emotional talk, gets people ready to play. Um, but I suppose on pitch there isn't a huge difference if you've got a non-play coach, because obviously they'll do all the talk and the captain just takes all the glory. Now that people can apply for it, what do candidates for Team UK coach need? Uh, they've got to know the game. They've got to know all the ins and outs, not just of the UK game. They've got to have gone to Europe. They've got to be watching the American games, know the Australian game, everything really. They've just got to know Quidditch. What's the hardest decision you've had to make? The hardest decision was easily uh, trying to choose how do you see the UK scene evolving with freshers and graduates freshers are always getting bigger stronger faster so the athleticism in the game is constantly getting greater and greater it's putting an added strain onto you know the older players um, but as people are graduating then nobody seems to like it that much especially myself um, but it's good because then they go off usually try and make their own team or go to a team local to them and it might be that they actually help to advance that team just the experience really so we're getting more athletic and more general experience across the country what are Kiel's objectives for this season Win. knock Oxford off the number one spot um, remind people that we're a force to be reckoned with uh, Go for gold. With Valentine's Cup incoming, do you have any tips for captaining a Merc team? Uh, have a game plan. Um, you know your players by now, make sure you know everything you can do. Encourage them to make sure they're ready for what's to come. Uh, tactics. Make sure everybody knows how everyone plays. It's about the best you can do with a Merc tournament. You've once had the biggest role in Quidditch here. Now that you don't, what do you see yourself doing in this sport? Uh, one of my personal goals is to do my to I don't know, get back on my feet, uh, making sure I improve as a player individually, making sure I obviously do well, and just generally trying to help everything around the UK do whatever I can. What would you tell new coaches in need of inspiration? Just stick with it. Don't be afraid to ask for a QK for help because as much as everybody wants to win, I want everybody else to get better at the same time. Is it true you turned down the once in a lifetime chance of making an advert for Lori all over the summer to go to Canada for some reason? Well, you always have to put Quidditch first, don't you? I mean, 